Force Link. Well, preparing Air Force medical teams for duty in Iraq and Afghanistan is a critical job. Airman First Class Robbie Arp tells us about a program at Hurlburt Field in Florida that makes sure medical airmen are prepared for what they'll encounter in a combat zone. Students in the Tactical Operations Medical Skills, or TOMS lab, of the Casualty Evacuation Course are learning to save lives with the sights and sounds of trauma. Realistic dummies, or meta-mannequins, breathe, bleed, and even react to medicine. We can set up realistic training scenarios for our uh, pararescue and our other warfighters so that they can come in and have a realistic war scenario where they can come in and actually run a scenario like they would see in real life. Instructors can change temperatures, play sounds of war, and even change lighting to add the sensations of a stressful environment. This is the best, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's real as you can get, you know, close as you can get to being out there and uh, taking care of those, the uh, patients out in combat. We can't take a, a regular patient out or a regular human being out and chop their leg off and let these guys practice on them. So but with this guy, we can. We can take his leg off. We can give him a real life uh, simulation for them to work on. Knowledge is power, and with this hands-on training, may be a lifesaver. When the time to deploy comes for these students, they'll have the lessons of the Tom's Lab to help them bring our wounded troops home. Airman First Class Robbie Arp, Herbert Field, Florida.